The island of Majorca is battling with extreme storms as hurricane force winds of more than 75 miles per hour and torrential rain batter the popular holiday resort. Stunned holidaymakers have shared footage of tourists running for shelter as sunmongers were sent flying across swimming pools and beaches on the Spanish island, which is usually associated with blistering heat and glorious sunshine in August. A small number of people are also being treated for minor injuries after a P&O cruise ship broke free from moorings and collided with a freight vessel during the storm. Hotel resorts have been left unrecognizable after being lashed by fierce winds, rain, and hail. Local media reports that there were more than 80 flood-related incidents on the island within an hour this morning. Terrifying Brits have told Mail Online that they don't dare go out as savage winds pummeled the island and left hotel guests unable to go outside out of fear of being injured. Families also described their young children being frightened of the lightning, while others said they had never seen so much rain in one day. Palm trees have come crashing down and flying debris has been launched across resorts, while motorists were also struggling to navigate through flooded roads and poor visibility. Forecasters have warned that storms show no sign of stopping tonight. It comes as severe warnings were issued across the holiday hotspots of Majorca, Ibiza, Menorca, and Formentera on Sunday. More than 100 flights were canceled or diverted at Palma, Ibiza, and Menorca due to strong winds and rain. Spanish forecasters said winds reached more than 75 miles per hour at the Cap de Pera lighthouse in Majorca. <laughs>
Torrential outbreaks of rain and gusts of up to 120 kilometers, 75 miles per hour have hit the islands. The conditions led to the cancellation of over 20 flights, Spain's airport operator said. Weather warnings for parts of the archipelago have been extended until Monday. The captain informed passengers that there's no structural compromise, but Deck 5 has sustained a small amount of damage on the PA system. P&O Cruises spokesperson said they were aware of an incident involving Britannia on Sunday morning and were working to assess the situation. Mr. McCoy said that everyone was safe and there was no problem on the ship apart from a few scrapes and bumps to one or more lifeboats that project from the ship. Depends on the first one. Oh, I'm going to take you out this one. 